As everyone probably knows by now, Thabo Mbeki is the second president to serve in the Democratic of South Africa. Like his predecessor Mandela, Mbeki too has had his fair share of fighting for liberation of the country. Although it gets less talked about, but nonetheless, he was a freedom fighter. During his presidency, the country was experiencing a steadily growing economy. Crime rate was low. He established scorpions to tackle corruption within ANC's cabinet members. It obviously goes without saying that Tamu Beki had his flaws too during the time when he was president. Beki was one of the few who denied that HIV ultimately caused AIDS if left untreated and suppressed with ARVs. Mbeki believed in his stance so much that he bluntly refused to sign off the rollout of ARVs in the country despite thousands of people dying. Instead, Mbeki recommended that people take a beetroot and try living a balanced lifestyle. In his personal life, Mbeki has been married to Zane Lembeki since 1974 due to apartheid. They didn't get to see each other that much, but that didn't stop their love from burning. They don't have any children of their own. When Becky was 16 years old in 1959, he impregnated Olive Mpwarwa in Butterworth, Eastern Cape, and together they had a son who was called Nonwabi Sinkwanda Mbeki. In 1976, after he heard that Tabo was in exile, Nonwabisi decided to follow him, but unfortunately, that was the last people have heard of him. Apartheid took Mbeki's son away.